What is up, Matt Superstars? In this edition of Mr. Peterson Presents, we're talking about how to figure out the stop locations for your trip. And so what you're going to do, very first step, is you're going to go to drive.google.com, and you're going to make sure that you log in with your LCPS email address. So you can see I'm logged in. My icon's up here. What you're going to do is you're going to click on New, go to More, and then Google My Maps. And so this is going to give us a map of the United States of America. And so you have a couple things you're gonna do first. You're gonna actually title your map. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna do your name. So I'll do Mr. Peterson's Road Trip of Awesomeness. If I can spell it correctly, awesomeness. You're gonna add a description. So in your description, you're gonna put your final location down there which I'm gonna do mine as, uh, let's pick St. Louis, Missouri. And then I'm gonna hit save. So you can tell that worked because you have Mr. Peterson's Road Trip of Awesomeness in my final location. So we need to get some driving directions. So some real basic driving directions. There's this arrow right here, it says add directions. So I'm gonna go ahead and click that. And then you have an untitled layer here, and you got a little card that says you're going to be driving, because you're going to drive, it's a road trip, but it does have other options. You can actually bike and walk, but for the sake of today, you're going to be driving. And so in letter A, you're going to type in Stone Hill, and then it will give you a, it will fill it in, so you want Stone Hill Middle School. And I'm going to type in my final location as St. Louis, Missouri, and so it already starts to autofill it. Just make sure you click the right one. You don't want St. Louis Park, Minneapolis. You want St. Louis, Missouri. And you can see here it gives you this lovely little map here with these directions from Stonehill and it goes up through Maryland, through Ohio and Indiana, down to St. Louis is on the border of Illinois and Missouri. And so in picking some stops, you wanna break up your trip into three equal parts here. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to travel my road trip and I might stop at, let's say I'm going to stop at Pittsburgh is going to be my first stop. So I'm going to click and drag my little dot to Pittsburgh. Or I might, what I just am going to do is I'm going to add Pittsburgh PA as a stop. And what I can do is I should be able to drag this and place it in the proper place here. So you can see I added Pittsburgh so I wanted it for my first stop and I put it before St. Louis and it adjusts the map. So say as I'm going along on my trip, I might pick Indianapolis. So as a second stop, so I'm gonna type in Indianapolis and it auto corrects. But you gotta remember to make sure to click and drag it in the right location. And so now I have, so I'm starting at Stonehill, I'm gonna stop in Pittsburgh and then I'm gonna stop in Indianapolis and then I'm gonna stop in St. Louis. So you got some great directions to start, but you have to remember to make it home. And so I might add a destination here. So when I add a destination, I might say I'm gonna go to Cincinnati, Ohio might be my next stop. So I'm gonna type in Cincinnati is my next stop. So it gives me directions to Cincinnati, very nice. And then I might go, you know, I might stop somewhere in West Virginia. And so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna zoom my map in. And I might say, you know what, I'm gonna aim for, let's zoom in a little more, because the more you zoom in, the more cities it's gonna give. So maybe I might stop in, maybe I'll aim for, what's in, what's in Wheeling? Wheeling looks like a big city, because the name is a little bigger. So I'm gonna try Wheeling, West Virginia. Do I know what's in Wheeling? I have no clue what's in Wheeling, but I'm gonna find out. So I got Cincinnati, I got Wheeling, and then I'm gonna hit Stonehill Middle School's my end location. So you can see I have Stonehill, Pittsburgh, Indianapolis, and then St. Louis is my final location. And then I'm going Cincinnati, Wheeling, and Stonehill. So to get the total mileage of this trip, click on the three dots. Step-by-step -step directions will give me my total mileage is 1,681 miles. And so this is the end of this video because you have, you have your stops planned to there and back using Google My Maps. 
And what you're going to do is to get your total mileage. Once again, you're going to click the three dots and then step-by-step -step directions to get the total mileage.